and we stand for our pledges. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. I pledge allegiance to the cross of our Lord Jesus Christ and to the faith for which it stands, one Savior, eternal, with mercy and grace for all. All right, and it is Thursday, December 10th. As we'll light, we'll do Psalm 163, the first two verses. Light one candle for hope, one bright candle for hope. He brings hope to every heart. He comes, he comes. Light one candle for peace, one bright candle for peace. He brings peace to every heart. He comes, he comes. We make our beginning in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Today's reading comes from Luke 2, verses 4 and 5. And Joseph also went up from Galilee, from the town of Nazareth to Judea, to the house of David, which is called Bethlehem, because he was of the house and lineage of David, to be registered with Mary, his betrothed, who was with child. Christmas time is here. A time when sounds of carols ring through the air. A time to gather together and remember the true meaning. Isn't there anyone who knows what Christmas is all about? I can tell you what Christmas is all about. By Caesar's request, Joseph and Mary went to the town of Bethlehem to register. The time came for Mary to have her baby. There was no vacancy at the inn. So Mary wrapped the baby with cloths and laid him in a box where the animals fed. There were shepherds in the field, keeping watch over their flock by night. Long ago, God the Father made a promise. God promised to send a Savior. The promise of a Savior came true. I lost four. One day, an angel came to visit Mary. The angel said, you will have a baby. The baby will be God's son. You will name the baby Jesus. Joseph took Mary to be his wife. An order came to be counted. Joseph and Mary traveled to Bethlehem. And Joseph also went with Mary, his betrothed, Luke 2, 4, and 5. And we pray. Lord, thank you for this new day. Thank you that we are here to serve you. Be with all of us this day as we do our work, visit, and do some playing even. Please be with us now. Be with our families. Be with those who are sick and suffering. And hear all the prayers in our hearts, dear Lord. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. 